Hello, hello, everyone, and welcome to today's episode of Health at Home. Today, we're talking about hormones. And remember, Health at Home is an academy that I created to help teach on different topics of health. So what exactly are hormones? Well, in short, hormones travel through blood cells, um, and many different hormones can be present in the blood at one time. Each hormone affects only a certain type of cell known as a target cell. And as a hormone travels to the target cell, it kind of gets a lock on it. And when that happens, that's when the hormone signals the cell to start or stop certain activities. Essentially, your hormone, hormones are messenger carriers. Um, so to get a better idea of how that works, I don't know how, how nerdy you guys are. I don't know how many people read comic books. Um, but hormones are like arrows, specifically the arrows that are used by Hawkeye. Hawkeye is a comic book character that has different arrows that do different things. So if you're Hawkeye or the horm um, and you're directing the hormone, essentially, think of the arrow like the hormone. This hormone has several jobs. It has to travel to its intended target. So it's got to fly through the air, the arrow does. Um, it has to hit the target accurately, so the aim has to be on point, and then it has to signal the target to perform an action depending on what kind of arrow it is. Really great general hormone solutions. Well, leafy greens are always a great option, and I'm going to go into some more specific food points here in a minute, um, but in particular, like leafy greens like kale, collard greens, and mustard greens because they're so powerful and so underestimated. And I know this because I did it on myself. Um, I was on Synthroid and Tyrosint. So I had tried two different thyroid medications before I started working at the Thermography Center and before I rebuilt my immune system. And after I rebuilt my immune system by doing nine weeks, that is correct, nine weeks of steamed vegetables, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, I was able to get off my thyroid meds completely because I had changed the environment of my body so dramatically that the thyroid medication was no longer needed. Um, something else that we have access to is a bunch of really fun, cool tools that do things like hormone balancing. 